Welcome to another reading from Class 8 English Textbook, Unit 2, An Expedition, called A Visit to Godavari. Grade 8 students of Kharkalakshmi School went for a visit to Godavari in Lalitpur district. They studied about many plants there and enjoyed its scenic beauty. When they returned to school, Srijana, the leader of the visiting team, answered the questions asked by the students who were unable to attend the trip. Binod, tell us something interesting about Godavari. Srijana, Godavari is a beautiful place situated at the base of a hill full of exotic and local plant varieties. The fern and orchid houses are very popular. The Japanese garden which is in the northwestern part of the area, is also a sight to see. This lush region is the home of many plants. There are four types of oak trees with their leaves remaining green all the year round. In addition, rhododendrons, wild walnuts, dark chestnuts, and Himalayan maples are other species found in this garden. As its climate is subtropical, more than 529 species of butterflies and plants are found in Godavari. Mamta, did you have to write about what you observed in Godavari? Srijana, yes, of course. We were asked to write a short report on Godavari's butterflies and animals. In April and May, butterflies Many of them with gleaming swallow tails flock around beautiful flowers. Godavari is a shelter for over a hundred species of butterflies ranging from drab beaks to blue peacocks. Anuj, I have heard Godavari is a famous picnic spot as well. Is it true? Srijana, that's right. Godavari's beauty and plants attract many people who go there to enjoy a picnic. Especially on Saturdays, large groups of people gather there for cookouts. Varieties of food items are prepared and served in paper or leaf plates because they are biodegradable. Picnics are often associated with festivals and are a long-standing tradition in Nepal. Picnics have been part of the social harmony for centuries. People enjoy eating, participate in dancing, singing, and other fun events at picnics. Asha, how can we reach there from Kathmandu? Srijana, Godavari is within easy reach of Kathmandu's ring road. You can take a public vehicle, minibus, microbus, or private car or taxi to go there. Anil, how would you appeal people to visit Godavari? Srijana, well, visiting places like Godavari provide us with recreation and inspiration to study nature. We are nature lovers and it is a part of our lives. In this sense, Godavari is worth visiting.